All right, well, most people in Milwaukee know about the elegant dining experience that you get at any of the Bartolotta restaurants, but did you know Bartolotta's has other event spaces too? Bartolotta Catering and Events brings their award-winning cuisine and first-class service to several different and one-of-a-kind venues that offer a beautiful backdrop for any type of affair. So come with me as I explore the Grain Exchange. Maria, we are here in the Grain Exchange in the Mackey Building. This is just one of the most beautiful spaces in all of Milwaukee. Well, I couldn't agree with you more. <laughs> I think it is absolutely magnificent. Uh, this room was built in 1879 as a warehouse. This was a warehouse? Yeah. yeah. Milwaukee exported more grain than any other city in the country, and so that's how it got the name of the Grain Exchange, and we set all the wheat prices nationwide. Eleanor Ashley, her husband Charles, bought the building and uh, she made this an event venue in 1980. That was the first renovation, bought a lot of catering and events. We renovated it in 2008 and we have our great culinary staff and our wonderful event planners here and this beautiful venue. I don't know that a lot of people know that Bartolotta isn't just a restaurant group, that you have all this catering and these event spaces. Absolutely. We have magnificent restaurants and what sets us apart from all the other caterers mm -hmm. is that our culinary staff actually works in the restaurants and then they go into our catering venues and they create restaurant quality food. Now Discovery World, they built this amazing uh, pilot house. Mm -hmm. Now the pilot house is on top probably three, four stories high. It is a 360 degree um, ballroom with panoramic views of both Lake Michigan and Milwaukee skyline. It is magnificent. Floor to ceiling windows and then it has an outdoor patio that goes around the building. The north lawn has the pavilion. It also has um, four walls, all glass, and it has um, an outdoor patio as well. And it holds about 900 people in there. How about the Italian Community Center? Being Italian. <laughs> You? I, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bartolotta. I kind of grew up there, um, so I have wonderful, wonderful memories there. And all of us as a family were very involved there. And when this opportunity presented itself, it's a no-brainer. Mm -hmm. We got ourselves involved and we renovated it. So it's not the Italian Community Center that it used to be. It has this huge grand ballroom and it also has the Festa Ballroom and it's modern and it's um, crisp and it's bright. The other one is the Downtown Kitchen. That's in the U.S. Bank building, right? That's correct. And that's mm -hmm. what, an urban kitchen space? It is. And we're open breakfast and lunch. Okay. But because it's so different, we can utilize that for other events. We do, they do happy hours there. They have a built-in bar um, and it, it is very urban. It's very hip, it's very trendy and people are very drawn to it because it's so different. Nothing happens in any of our venues without great vendors. We work with great people, as you know, that's what makes it happen. And I just like to thank Shorewood Florist for providing these beautiful flowers. We used Windy City and Canopies events of December. Distinction, they help us look good. So it's thank so you. It's so true. And you got to look good so you can eat well. Because we're going to try some of your food, right? <laughs> Absolutely. Let's get there. Let's All right, go. let's do it. <laughs> okay, Maria, we're up here for the food. But I got to ask, like, what's up with the Christmas stuff? I wasn't ready for that. Well, <laughs> we love the holidays around here, and there's a never a bad time for a little Christmas. I know with the Christmas stuff, too, you've got this Dickens dinner coming up. Correct. So for the Dickens dinners, it's open to the public. It's, um, $95 all-inclusive for adults, $45 for children. If you sit down, we'll go around with butler style past appetizers, mm -hmm. and we roast these beautiful prime ribs. And then we have carolers, which sing Aww. beautiful, beautiful carols of, of the time. One of them plays Charles Dickens. Charles Dickens himself? Yes, <laughs> of course. And he reads excerpts from a Christmas carol. We have these wonderful poppers. You pull these and then there's all these prizes in oh, here. That's and that's neat. We make everybody wear these little that's paper fun. crowns and it's like the Cracker Box. Uh, so you get like a fancy dinner while doing a really fun family friendly event. It is. So this is on our menu year round. I'm gonna okay. let you try these. These are two of my favorite dishes. Okay. We have the Tuscan chicken here. They marinated in extra virgin olive oil and it's pan seared oh, so skin side down. And then they finish it in the oven. It has rosemary roasted potatoes and caramelized Brussels sprouts. Oh my God, that's so die for. Isn't that good? 
that sauce. Isn't that great? Yeah. That is incredible. Yeah. Now this, like you said, short ribs, this is what I would order on a, like a wedding menu when you're mm -hmm. given the choice. I always go for the short ribs. Right. Short ribs sometimes can be a little fatty. Mm -hmm. It is boneless. There's no fat. It is, wow, falls off, yeah, falls off the so fork soft. and so tender. It is made with a that. reduction of red wine and Door County cherries. It has a, um, a sweet potato puree, kale that's sauteed with a little bit of garlic, and it's just, it's, oh okay, my gosh. it's pretty amazing, right? That is incredible. And look at the colors, it's just a pretty plate. Yeah. Okay, so, so the food's really good, obviously the events are good, how about the drinks? Ooh, <laughs> and my favorite, look at this, we have some martinis, right. and John Halverson, our operations manager, is going to walk us through these and we're going to taste them. Mix it up, John. Come on. All right. Hi, Tiffany. Hi. How are you? Nice to see you nice again. Nice to see you. So yeah. I'm going to make a chocolate peppermint martini. Mmm, peppermint schnapps. With his love vodka. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because I have a chocolate liqueur. Oh. Mm -hmm. chocolate. Mm -hmm. And then a little half and half. Okay. Okay, sounds good. So we'll just shake this up. Oh all right, gosh, Tiffany. Delicious. This is all you. All right. There you go. All right, cheers, cheers. to Bartoladas and all the premier spots and catering food and the Dickens I for love the holidays. holidays. Happy honey. holidays. Thank cheers. you. Cheers. Mmm. It was so good. Okay, so, so cool. here's the information on that Dickens dinner at the Grain Exchange. You got to go. It's running for four nights. It's December 18th through the 21st. There's a three course dinner and includes a wine pairing. It's going to be so cool. Charles Dickens comes to read everything. And whether you're celebrating your uh, special day with 5, 50, 500, or 5,000 people, Bartolotta Catering and Events can make your event a one of a kind experience. All you have to do to learn more is visit their website. It's bartolottas.com slash catering. And I said, like, we left there. And I swear, we all had like the biggest crush on Maria. She's just like. She's adorable. Adorable. Comfortable, friendly. Yeah. That was fantastic. You feel like family with the Bartolottas. What a great tour. Mm -hmm.